Hi there, Lloyd Macedo speaking to you from LloydMacedo.com and uh, I got an email from Chaco J, all right, um, not his real name, but anyway, uh, he says he's a medical student, well actually, it, uh, this is what he writes, I'm a doctor, I've got only one more month before I get my MBBS degree in hand and I can legally start practicing medicine, my question to you is, what do you do when you have two passions in mind that burn equally bright, I love medicine and I love aviation and I'm good at both of them, okay, and then he writes a long letter, uh, stating that he knows everything from fire, flight mechanics, avionics, operating flight systems, everything else. He has put himself through a lot of flight test simulators and he has done really well. But uh, see, this is the part that really gets to me. It says that I'm really confused because I want to do both, but my parents will kill me because it's obviously being a doctor, according to them, is much more respectable. Uh, it has better earnings. Uh, you earn 10 to 12 times better. People tell me to follow my passion, but I have both. So what do I do? Now, see, Chaco, uh, let me tell you this. It's great to have multiple interests. I have a lot of interests that I also like. But I think what you need to do at this point of your life is you need to be realistic. See, the reason why you're, you're uh, having the, the luxury of having quite a number of uh, interests is because your parents are paying for your bills. Your parents are paying for your bills. You're not paying for your bills. So I think you need to be re pretty realistic. Let's say... Suppose something happens to your mother and father that they die or, um, you know, you lose all your money. So obviously you got to grab onto whatever you have. And what you have right now is being a doctor. Okay. Now I'm saying this only because you have stated that you're passionate about being a doctor. Forget the money, forget the respect, forget the uh, societal standings. Just, just fuck all that. All right. Just, just leave all that. Focus on what you're good at. Okay. Um, now, if you're good at being a doctor, now look at it this way. Uh, you become the world's best doctor. Don't just be a doctor. Be the world's best doctor. Earn good money. In, in some countries, they really pay you a lot of money to become, you know, a reputed doctor. So earn a lot of money. And with that money, pursue this passion of flying. Maybe you can have, uh, maybe you can do it as a hobby. Maybe you can, you can uh, do it as, um, you know, business. Maybe you can, you know, there are so many other things. Or maybe you can move into being a doctor and study avionics at the same time. And the day you're really good at it, maybe you can transfer. But here, let me give you food for thought. I have a couple of people who are into the field of aviation. And let me tell you this. It is very, very, very difficult. Unless you have uh, flying time, unless you have experience in the air, nobody is going to give you a contract. In fact, most of the people who are uh, struggling, they what they have told me is to be a pilot, you have to save at least uh, you know half a million to one million, uh, which you got to pay to get flying time. And only then you'll be considered to be a pilot for one of the reputed airlines. And that is where you can earn well. So if you ask me, I think right now you're on the right track. You just have one more month. Finish being a doctor. Get your, uh, uh, get your degree. Get your qualification. Start your career as a doctor. I don't say that uh, get rid of your passion of flying. But be realistic. Because first, make sure that you're independent. Make sure that you're taking care of your expenses, your bills. You're in a position to look after your parents, then start pursuing something else. Others, you'll not be this side, you'll not be that side, you'll be no way. It's like having two women. Don't pursue both the women at the same time. Get one woman, keep up for you, see how does it go, not happy, then you know, slowly start flirting around with the other one. And if it works out, okay, then transfer. You know, and don't put me on this. So, Chaco J, this is my opinion about having two passions at the same time. I think, my friend, you need to be realistic. Uh, you need to focus on what do you have. Just one more month, you're going to get qualified. You're going to be a doctor. Focus on that. Leave the aviation part because I, I, you know, out of what I hear from my friends, it's a very, very, very difficult industry. So the, you know, grass always looks green on the other side. So you know, just just evaluate your choices and be smart about it. I thank you a lot for sending me a confidential email, and uh, I hope this answers your question. Anything else? Let me know. Lloyd Macedo speaking to you from LloydMacedo.com. Goodbye for now.